I mean, in the video, though, I mean, you got gangster in that thing, too, yeah, man. Yeah. I mean, can you talk about gangster yeah. and the know you? Man, gangster, you, you can't say Magnolia without gangster, man. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Like, um, gangster was the face of the Magnolia. You know what I'm saying? Um, him with the rest of the hot boys. You know what I'm saying? Hot boy, um, hot, you know what I'm saying? Mosquito, um, Dooney, yeah. you know what I'm saying? Blabber, you know what I'm talking about? Um, it was a lot of them, bro. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? And um, them dudes put it down, bro. You know what I'm saying? They, they put it down, man. And when, when as we was coming up, you know, like we looked up to them. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? We came out with the star. Yeah. The five punch star, you know what I'm saying? Where everybody would think I think was Vice Lord or something. Yeah. But Hot Boy represented a superstar, that what that was, but they oh, came hard. out with the pepper, the jalapeno pepper. Uh, you know what I'm saying? So when they was doing what they was doing, you know what I'm talking about being hot boys, you know, hot police or uh, running from the police in the hood or whatever, whatever, you know what I'm saying? The girls jocking them and they pulling up in the whips and the foreigns way back in the days. Yeah. They was hot boys, you That's feel right. me? So we idolized that shit. And we just took it to the whole nother level around the world, dog. It made the world get up on what a hot boy was from the younger generation standpoint. Yeah. But them niggas was the originators, and nobody can't take that away, dog. One thing about me, I always, if I can remember, yeah. I'm going to give people they credit, man. Because one thing about it, you can't take away credit from what somebody done did. You can't erase history. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So when I speak on... Gangsta, I'm speaking of the history as I know gangsta. Yeah. You feel me? And not from how people be feeling however they feel about gangsta. You know what yeah. I'm saying? That's why when 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 I interview gangsta on my um podcast, I'm a yeah. podcaster. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? I was one of the first ones to 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 embrace gangsta, you know what I'm saying, as far as on a podcast outside yeah. of whatever he was doing before that. But me being from the Magnolia, yeah. you know what I'm saying? I think that kind of like solidified it a little bit to let people see, man, where Turk doing this, you know, whatever else going on, I don't have nothing to do with it. It ain't my business. You yeah. feel me? I got respect for homie. You feel me? Just like anybody else. And nobody can make me not have respect for anybody. You feel me? Yeah. And I'm going to express that to the world, dog. Like, I don't have to be... In, in secret to say who I got respect for, you feel me? Yeah. So people just get <laughs> mad because a lot of people be faking. Yeah, you know what I'm talking about. You'll have people behind doors. I know people be watching gangster people talking to gangster people doing all that. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. But the social media make you look a certain way, bro. Telling the truth is not hating. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. My whole movement is the truth. Yeah, you feel me? If you don't like me, I mean that's how you feel. That's your feelings, not my facts. You feel me? Well, what? I